Have you ever considered that while the world is still vying for air supremacy with fifth-generation fighters, China has quietly opened the door to sixth-generation air combat? In late autumn of 2025, at the historic moment marking the 76th anniversary of the People's Air Force, the official deployment of the Attack 11 stealth drone, codenamed Zhuanlong, signifies not only China's status as the world's first nation to deploy stealth unmanned attack aircraft in combat, but also the emergence of a new combat capability centered on intelligent unmanned swarms. The wings of this dark knight dragon are reshaping the very DNA of future warfare. The stealth artistry of the GJ-11 represents the pinnacle of engineering pursuit. Its flying wing configuration is not merely an aerodynamic innovation, but the optimal solution derived from hundreds of thousands of electromagnetic simulations. The Matt Gray nanoscale radar absorbing coating on its surface contains millions of magnetic microsphere units that convert incoming radar waves into dissipated thermal energy through resonance. Even more astonishing is its ability to trigger distinct impedance matching mechanisms under different radar frequency bands, exhibiting high impedance against L-band early warning radars while automatically switching to low impedance when encountering X-band fire control radars. This intelligent stealth capability allows it to navigate complex electromagnetic environments with ease. The precision strike capability of this war machine is equally awe-inspiring. Its two large internal weapon bays beneath the fuselage feature a modular design, enabling full system weapon reconfiguration within two hours. For deep strike missions, it can carry eight 50-kilogram small-diameter precision-guided bombs. With a circular error probability of 0.5 meters, it delivers surgical strikes against fortified bunkers. When tasked with air defense suppression, it can be reconfigured with four anti-radiation missiles. Coupled with its onboard electromagnetic spectrum sensing system, it can automatically lock onto and destroy radar emitters within 200 kilometers. During a recent live fire exercise, 6GJ11S simultaneously destroyed 16 critical nodes of a simulated S-400 air defense position within just 138 seconds under intense electromagnetic jamming. Throughout the entire process, from target identification to strike completion, enemy radar screens failed to establish stable tracking. The GJ-11's most revolutionary breakthrough lies in its swarm intelligence. Each drone carries an onboard I system with computing power equivalent to one-third of the Tanha-2 supercomputer, enabling microsecond-level information exchange via quantum encrypted data links. In a typical tactical formation, two J-20S stealth fighters can command 12 Attack-11 drones to form three combat clusters. The Vanguard cluster conducts electronic reconnaissance and jamming, the main force cluster executes precision strikes, while the reserve cluster handles battle damage assessment and supplementary strikes. This decentralized combat model ensures that even if 30% of units are shot down, the remaining units can redistribute tasks through a self-organizing network, maintaining system-level combat effectiveness. Particularly noteworthy is the maritime adaptation variant of the GZ-11. Its wing folding mechanism utilizes shape memory alloy materials, enabling automatic wing extension within three seconds upon receiving a specific frequency signal from the ship's electromagnetic catapult system. The belly arresting hook, crafted from super-elastic titanium alloy, withstands 6G impact loads. These innovations enable seamless adaptation to the demanding carrier deck operations. Military analysts project that each Type 076 amphibious assault ship could carry 812 GZ-11S, forming stealth partnerships with J-35 carrier-based fighters to extend naval aviation strike ranges beyond 1,500 kilometers. The training deployment on the Qinghai Tibet Plateau further demonstrated its full-terrain deployment capability. The J-11 attack aircraft's engine air intakes were specially equipped with a plateau anti-icing system, enabling stable operation in extreme temperatures ranging from minus 40 degrees C to 55 degrees C. Its onboard systems also feature combustion control algorithms optimized for the low oxygen environment of high altitudes allowing the UAV to maintain 85% payload capacity during takeoff and landing at airports at 5,000 meters above sea level. This summer, an Attack 11 detachment successfully completed a 72-hour combat readiness patrol in the Karakaram Mountains without any maintenance or resupply, demonstrating remarkable environmental adaptability. Comparisons with U.S. counterparts further highlight its capabilities. While the U.S. Air Force's Skyborg program remains in foundational algorithm validation, the Attack 11, 
has achieved deep tactical data link integration with the KJ-500 early warning aircraft. Its onboard I system, through deep reinforcement learning, has mastered autonomous penetration decision-making in complex electromagnetic environments. In a recent simulated engagement, 4G-11S successfully penetrated an air defense network comprising three Arla Burke-class destroyers, while their commanding J-20S remained safely outside the defense perimeter at 200 kilometers. The rapid deployment of the G-11 reflects the comprehensive breakthrough of China's military innovation system. From its debut at the 2019 military parade to achieving full combat readiness, the GZ-11 program has set multiple records, completing high-altitude adaptation modifications in just 18 months and integrating its combat systems with the J-20 within 24 months. This rapid development pace stems from collaborative efforts by over 500 research institutes and defense enterprises nationwide, particularly breakthroughs in critical areas like flight control algorithms, stealth materials, and intelligent swarm technology. This unmanned combat platform is catalyzing a new tactical revolution. Guided by penetrative air superiority doctrine, AG-11 swarms can breach enemy air defense networks, clearing safe corridors for subsequent manned fighters. With 24-hour endurance, they can establish stealth patrol zones over critical airspace, posing sustained threats to high-value targets like enemy tankers and early warning aircraft. More notably, the GJ-11 provides a complete Chinese solution for the concept of loyal wingman drones, capable of serving as a force multiplier for the J-20 while also forming independent, distributed kill networks. From a broader strategic perspective, the GJ-11 service entry signifies the PLA Air Force's formal entry into the era of intelligent air force development. It represents not merely a breakthrough in individual equipment, but a microcosm of generational leaps across the entire combat system. While Western military experts debate the technical standards for sixth-generation fighters, China has provided its own answer with the GJ-11. Future air combat will be dominated by intelligent unmanned swarms and systemic confrontation, and China has already seized the initiative in this race. As foreign media commentary observes, the emergence of the GJ-11 redefines the operational paradigm for stealth aircraft. The ascent of this mysterious dragon not only alters regional power balances, but profoundly influences the direction of global military transformation. On future battlefields, we may witness this scene, swarms of GJ-11S, like the mystical Zhuangxiang formation from ancient military strategy, weaving an invisible hunting network across the skies. All of this began with this special gift, the Chinese Air Force presented itself for its 76th anniversary this autumn.